size of that. No thanks. Got my new boots on. Got these from Zara. Do 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 do. That don't look great. Oh, I've got them like that, but yes. We are now in New York. It's the day after. Last night we just had a little walk down to like Times Square. We got some pizza and then we pretty much just fell asleep. <laughs> so I think it's like seven or eight-ish now. Um, we're going to walk up to the Rockefeller, have a look around there. Um, I'll try and quickly show you the room. It's not massive. In fact, it's tiny. <laughs> but I don't think you come to New York and like have a huge room unless you're paying like 10 grand but it is very cute it's very like nicely done it feels a little bit like an ikea room set obviously we've got our stuff now so it looks a little bit messy but i will try and show you around so this my boyfriend is just not a tidy person um so this is the little like sink area the sink is not in the bathroom which is a little bit weird but yeah we've got a mirror there mirror bit there with all our stuff none of it looks particularly tidy and then there's loads of like these hooks all along the wall so you can put all your coats and stuff which i think is really good for like a winter time there's also like loads of bits hung up here so you've got stuff to put your suitcase on you've got a little table like another little chair thing so it's very like diy ish but i quite like it like that this is the bed it does feel quite student eh? but i quite like that then this is the bathroom the bathroom's actually really lovely so shower, really good shower, very clean, so nice little towels, toilet there, da da da. It's very functional, that's what I'd describe it as, but it's also quite stylish. This is what I'm wearing today, excuse the pizza box. I've got a skirt on from Topshop, boots from Mango, and then just like a little basic roll neck. I'm gonna wear this coat, so this is my House of CB one, which is huge. Um, it's not actually that cold in New York at the minute, so I'm not going too crazy wrapping up. I've got proper like boot socks on, but yeah, it's not that cold. We'll see how we go. <gasps> this feels really Christmassy. You can't really tell the colour. ones that have got cranes on in front of Central Park. Yeah. Do you always think, imagine if everyone in these buildings came down at the exact same time. Shut up Daniel. What? <laughs> what do you mean came down? That is it all just left the building. Oh I thought you time. meant that if the buildings came down. <laughs> no. <laughs> Welcome back to the room. We've got a DIY assemble shake shack. I've got a mushroom burger which might I don't know. Mushroom burger be nice, but cheesy bacon fries. We're going out, I look like shite, but we're going back out now. We're going to go to the flat iron, which I love. It's my favourite, well, one of my favourite places in New York. Macy's is the most Christmassy ever, I love it. So cute. Stuart Weisman. Look at these, how beautiful are they? So nice. I love these. It's a bit hot. 
Really, I need something like this to walk around in. That's probably all that I'd be comfortable in at the minute. We've just come to the flat iron to have a little nose, eh? Where is it? Is that it? That's a tree. No, it was the flat iron. The flat iron's behind us anyway. We've come down and now we're just sat. People washing, looking at the tree. It is beautiful. That, that up there is the Empire State and it's all like fogged over and even though it's raining it does feel Cute. It's a bit quieter down here. We just said we're gonna go back because we're knackered. Beat it. Morning, so we're at the High Line today. We overdid it completely yesterday walking so i think we're going to take it a bit steadier today we're going to have a walk down here go to chelsea market and then we've got the bali tonight got my new jumper on from h&m it's a bit like a christmasy one but not too christmasy asos jeans zara boots I'm gonna quickly film my night out outfit. This does not look great. I'm stood. I'm not taking my camera out tonight. I don't wanna lose it. We're going to the ballet. So I'll show you what I'm wearing. It's not quite as thigh as this would seem. So I've got my House of CB coat. I'm gonna take that off. Um, and then I've got this set from Never Fully Dressed. So it's like a silky orange and navy set you can sort of tie the skirt different so you've got more of your leg out i'm not gonna have too much out of the belly um and then my mango boots so yeah basic face and i just wanted to be sort of comfortable in this we're going to watch the nutcracker which is going to be so cute i can't wait and um i think then we might pop to the rockefeller on the way back like just to see it in the dark because we've not actually seen it in the dark yet so yay i need to go now because my boyfriend's gonna go freaking mad he's waiting downstairs for me <laughs> morning everyone so it's sunday it's our last full day tomorrow we go home but today we're going to go to central park and do our sunday walks we sort of did a new year's resolution to do a sunday walk every sunday um i'm not sure we've done it every sunday but we always get up on sunday and go somewhere even if it's only walking around meadow hall but yeah this is a sunday walk in central park so that'll be nice i think it is quite rainy and miserable today so i'm gonna get wrapped up i'm wearing like my most casual outfit so i'll show you that i've got thermal tights and thermal leggings on because they were see-through i got these from tk Myers, but yeah they're really see-through then this little top is from windsor and then i've got this jumper the jumper and jacket are both from asos and it's just like a proper kind of coat for New York that I think we need. Looks like that. And then I've just got these Zara boots on that I've had on all week. Better go now because as usual the boyfriend's waiting for me. Daniel's worrying about he may have potentially called the man's wall when he was actually talking about. What were you talking about? I took my side of the room. I said it's really small. This is a really, really small man walking together uh, upstairs. I'll show you the other thing. Uh, it is the rainiest day in New York. <laughs> I spent way too much in Sephora, um, so I'll show those bits later or something. And now we're going to have a walk, even though it's super rainy. <laughs> we were kind of hoping it might turn snow, but never mind. It's the evening now. We are off to town, downtown, for 
our dinner um, I've heard quite a few people go there so we've booked that I've got on my mango outfit so I bought this one a few weeks back it's just like a big chunky jumper and then these trousers which are really baggy for now I'm just going comfortable and then I'm wearing my House of CB coat so the brown one we've got barbecue chicken cauliflower and udon noodles yes the last little day we've just got this morning and we're all packed now so we're ready to get off i'll show you my outfit that i'm wearing to travel home in i've got on little flares from boohoo they're just like comfy ones and then this little top I don't, what does it say my darling it is never too late to begin again i'm not just really slow but I'm reading it backwards <laughs> I'm also taking out a couple of hat and jumper combos so I've got this one which is like a maroon one with Las Vegas on the front and then I've just got a plain blue one with a little pink hat so I'm going to take those out just so I can do a quick little outfit change and take a couple of pictures in these so quick little update on the things I've bought because there isn't that much I haven't actually gone that mad I didn't want to buy things just for the sake of it, so I've sort of only bought makeup, really. <laughs> I did buy this little, like, thermal high neck. Not really for New York, I just thought it was nice and sort of comfy. So this was from Uniqlo. It was only, like, $20, and, yeah, I just thought it was nice and soft, so got one of those. At Macy's, I got Brow Wiz. Now I've had my brows microbladed, I don't really need too much on my brows, but... Sometimes if I'm going for like a little bit of a darker brow, then I can fill them in with this. Also got the brush for my dip brow, just because I forgot to bring one. I did go a bit mad at Sephora. So I spent like $150, like that's ridiculous for how much stuff there is. Like it looks like nothing. I bought these little milk minis just because I thought that was a good way for me to give a few bits a go. I got one that's like a cooling water one. I just thought that might be nice and refreshing. This one is the watermelon brightening one. Then I bought the primer one, so this is like the blur one. Um, I have read that it's kind of difficult to use when it's this small, but I did just want to try it. And then a little highlight. This looks a bit dark for me actually, but we'll see. Creaseless Concealer by Tarte. I have bought one that's too dark as well in this. Probably better for when I've got fake tan on, but I do like the like consistency of it. It's really nice and it's quite thick, which I like in a concealer. Huda Beauty, just wanted to try one of the lip colours. This is lovely, I wore it last night and it's really nice. So, yeah, like that one. Um, a Sephora one, just as a little cheap one to try. It's the cream lip stain, I'm not sure what colour it is, but I'll pop that in the video, so you know. Just some little wipes to try. Hand sanitizer, not interesting, but yeah, spray hand sanitizer is much easier, I think. There seems to be loads of sheet masks in America, like there's so much more. So I bought like five of these different ones just to try and give a go. I could use them on the flight and just relax a little bit with one of those on. And then just a little creme brulee. Vaseline, so exciting. Oh, I did get this as well. So this is Belief, the True Cream Aqua Balm. I've not heard of this brand before, but I just saw this at the checkout and my skin has been awful while I'm here. I know a couple of people said it might be like the New York smog or something. So my skin's really spotty and I just wanted something like a nice thick moisturizer just to give my skin a bit of a treat while I'm here because I'm not too bothered about the spots but my skin just looks gross <laughs> so yeah because it's very white and I can brighten this up and it'll fit with my feed here <laughs> just sad but we thought we might as well go in and have a little look because we've been here a couple of times now and I feel like we should go in seeing as we've just been doing posy stuff all morning this is so Christmassy 